I feel like the dog, though, should count as um, two friends, not half a friend. Rune Factory 4! Start broadcast! Outweigh the sack. Yuck. 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 Bruh, who knows? Cool. I'm ready! Are you ready? Because I'm ready! And Rune Factory has its own very nice music, so we'll turn off Harris Heller. For now. It's Rune Factory 4! That's much too loud. It's much, much too loud. <laughs> Newlywed mode. I don't know what that is. Another episode. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Let's just go to the normal. The normal. <laughs> Destination, Selfia. I'm flying high, baby. Goodness, I'm so high up. I'm always a girl. Always. I'm always a girl. But I hate that she has to say, Goodness, I'm so high up. Yeah, no, it is. Oh, God. <laughs> you don't even know all the turnips. All the turnips, or was it, was it not turnips? I don't remember. I don't want to be, I don't want to be now. Goodness, I'm so high up. Yes, let's do this thing. The ship is heading to the town of Selvia. Heck yeah! And she's so cute. She's so cute, though. I love her. That town is famous for it. God. And I'm now trying to deliver this gift to her. I don't have much time. Excuse me. How close are we to Selfia? Oh, we're almost there. Oh, he's joyful. Oh, we're almost there! <laughs> Are you setting out to do a bit of sightseeing? Don't judge me for my voices, okay? <laughs> yes, something like that. It's a real nice town. Beautiful air and scenery, and got a great atmosphere. <laughs> you can feel the protection of the God when you're standing on them roads. <laughs> You'll enjoy your stay for sure. <laughs> I hope so. Dun dun dun. Psst, can you hear me? Yes, sir. By the way, what are we doing? What kind of idiot are you? You don't even know why we're here. Well, you always get mad when I ask. What? N nothing. We're here to see that person. Over there, see? Er, 
it's completely dark in here. Look through the hole, dumbass. Oh, oh yeah. Ah. Sigh. <sighs> I see. So it's that woman. We're going to make our move. You ready? Yes, sir. Rah! Oh my. Huh? <laughs> We're taking over the ship now. If you don't want to get hurt, do what we say. Got it? Just give us the thing and we'll let you go. The thing. That thing you're about to give the native dragon. <gasps> How did you know about that? Well, you'd be surprised what a little research will turn up. How could you possibly... Who... Who are you? This gift is very important. I won't just hand it over to a total stranger. It's alright, I've trained for emergencies like this. First, press L for L left pocket. Then I equip the broadsword and attack by pressing B. You want to fight? Let's do this. Yes, sir. Oops. I don't like the bird sword. I prefer the, sh the short sword. No. I don't remember which one I liked. How did these people know about this? just leaves them. <laughs> anyway, if someone's after it, I have to hurry. Hmm, not so fast. Ah! Well, there go the balls. Needs to lose it. <laughs> Finally. Phew. So what are we doing again? Just shut up and watch. Now then. It's time you tell us where that thing is hidden. Or else. Who am I? Huh? I... who am I? Hey, say something. But I thought you told me to keep my mouth shut. Whatever, just do as I say. Such a tyrant. Sorry. Um, excuse me? Huh? Er, uh, who are you? Hey, are you trying to play dumb with us? No, um, I really don't know. I'll ask you again, where the hell are you hiding that thing? That, 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 that wasn't what I... Whatever. I swear I don't know what you're talking about. Sir, sir! What is it? I thought I told you to shut up. Sir, it might be amnesia, sir. To be a voice actor. <laughs> I'm terrible. <laughs> what? Are you saying a little blow to the head like that caused amnesia? Sir, I don't know, sir, but maybe... Um, what? Perhaps, um, it is amnesia? How can you lose your damn memory so easily? You shouldn't cry over spilled milk, sir. I know that! Damn it. No, wait a minute. How do we know you're not just playing us like fools? This could be a trick, a dirty, rotten ploy. What? Huh? Oh, good point, sir. All right. Take this fool over there, and we'll see if a little spot of threatening brings out the truth. Understood, sir. Burp-a-derp. 
to do to me? Well, I'm going to... Uh, sir? What is it? How do threats work again? Oh, you poor blessed soul. Sweet summer child. <laughs> Just use the altitude, damn it! How? Do I have to explain everything? Threaten to kick this fool off the ship. Um, like this? Oops. Who the hell told you to actually kick, you dumbass? I think it's quite convenient that she falls... Right there. Convenient. Ah, dear me. What should I do? What? What? Someone just fall from the sky? A person? Mm. Hey there, are you alive? Can it be? Hello? You aren't dead, are you? <sighs> Ow. Wow. You are alive. Barely. Oh, barely. Are you injured? Um, my back hurts. Yes. But that's all. Um, only back pain after falling from the heavens? Just what kind of body do you have? What? A talking dragon? Huh? All right, I suppose introductions are in order. I Once of the legendary native dragons governing this world. And I don't care if you've fallen from above, you have no right to enter this chamber unpermitted. What's your name? What? Oh dear. Lady Venturswell! What in the world was that noise I just heard? <laughs> Egads! Who is this knave? Wait, Volcanon. But... I said wait. We're talking now. Forgive me. So who are you? Well... Um... Of course, I'm Kella. Obviously. Wow, these aren't very fast, huh? Must be the latency. Yes! Enter my birthday. Mm. Yes! Kappa, I think. You mustn't give a vague, non committal answer. Say it clearly. Um, that's the best I can do, I'm afraid. I can't remember anything else besides my own name. What? You speak the truth? Yes, ma'am. I see honesty in your eyes. But amnesia... I'm so sorry for your loss. Oh my god. You must be very confused losing your memory like this. But rest assured. I'll always be by your side. Oh, I can't breathe. Oh. Perhaps you're the princess we've been waiting for. Hmm. You do have an air of nobility about you. You 
must have lost your memory from the shock of the fall. Do you have any idea how or why you came to drop from above? Well, you see... Rebels, then, I suspected as much. They must be villains chasing after the princess. You're right, this can't be a coincidence. Oh, wait. That was Vincel. <laughs> Volcanic! Yes. Prepare a room for the princess. Right away! Excuse me. Do you mean a room for me? Of course. But I didn't fall down with the intent to stay here. <laughs> no doubt. Uh huh? Who would intentionally fall from the sky into a castle roof? Assassins. It seems the fates have decided your course. There's no need to worry, I assure you. You are here because you are meant to be here. But you shall live in this town, and perhaps in doing so, you may find clues leading to your identity. Seems the most logical course of action. Do you agree? I'm not sure I'd call that logical, but... Are you sure I can stay? Most certainly. Thank you very much. There's no need for that. However... I hope in addition to your own personal details, you've also forgotten the tone of voice I used earlier. way of speaking. You know only this, right? You've heard nothing else. <laughs> you do sound a little different, come to think of it. A little more arrogant, I guess. Sorry. So you do remember. Did you just... Did you just click your tongue derisively? Derisively? Derisive. If you heard the other side of me, I suppose there's nothing I can do about it. Oh well. Er, um, Lady Ventiswell? Right. Just call me Venti. Yeah. Venti? Sure, why not? At this point, I don't care if you address me with respect. That ship has sailed. Furthermore, stop speaking so politely. It makes me rather uncomfortable. Okay. Talk to me like we're old friends, alright? Blink, 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 blink. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma- yeah. Okay. All right. Good. Now listen. This is important. Do not let anyone else know about this. How much do you charge to read me things? <laughs> I actually used to um, read to my best friend when we were... Um, like all throughout middle school and high school she was dyslexic and so um for me to like share <laughs> for me to share like books with her it was faster if i just read them to her so i used to read out loud a lot do not let anyone else know about this all right about what the fact that i'm actually kind of informal by nature Oh-ho, so you keep that. Do you tell no one, understood? <laughs> yes, my... Venti. Hmm. Lady Bunderswill, the room is now ready. Well done. Your body must ache. Rest early today, princess. Let us go. Now, Lord Arthur, allow me to show you to your room. What? Arthur? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're just like, what? It's like cow and chicken, I think. I think one person voices all of them. Arthur? Yes. yes. I heard that the name of the princess is Arthur. But if that's the case, why would you call yourself by any by another name? Am I really a princess? I don't think my name is Arthur. Hmm. I see. Even the one thing you thought you remembered. It must be tough. Oh no, that's not what I'm saying. It's only natural that you'd be a bit bewildered. 
think it's best that you turn in early today. But... If you're a member of the royal family, your identity shall soon be learned. In which case, you would have to admit that you've forgotten your name. You can't! But I haven't forgotten. My name is Kala. Hmm, Kala. That's a hip with it sort of name. You may use that name for now if you wish. But I'm telling you, I'll leave the rest to you, Volcanon. Yes. Of course. Shall we go? I really don't think I'm a princess. First of all, isn't Arthur a boy's name? Mm -hmm. Okay. Kala. Yes? Don't forget about the promise we made earlier. What? You can't win. What? Have you already forgotten you and consider cur? About the way I talk. My secret casualness. <laughs> oh, okay. I remember now. Honestly, how could I have slipped up so bad? Be sure you keep your promise, or else. Okay, I will. Allow me to explain your housing arrangements. We don't need to go through this because it's basically just... Here's the save. Wait, where's my... Where's my journal? Uh, I mean, Volcano, if you just moved... Like... I don't know what he wanted. Uh, I guess I'll just talk to him. There we go. That's the save. Write a diary entry. Boop, boop. Next. My darling, it's time to wake up. Unconscious. Is she asleep? But I could have sworn she just looked at me. Sorry. Um, excuse me, are you awake? Morning. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. Was that breathing that I heard? Was that you or the game? That was the game. That was Clorica sleeping. <laughs> Let's see. I think I came in here for something. Oh dear, what it was it? Ah, that's right. Mr. Volcanon asked me to come wake you. Are you awake yet? Yes. Yes. Good morning. And I'm pleased to meet you. My name is Clorica, and I'm training to be a servant at this castle. I'm Kala. How strange. Mr. Volcanon said your name was Arthur. Oh, uh, no, my name is definitely Kala. I'd rather you call me that. Yes. As you wish, Kala. <laughs> that must have... That must have a really pretty spelling. Anyway, I'm not terribly sure what is going on, but I'll do my best to serve you. Thank you very much. Here, I made breakfast, so please eat it, if you'd like. I wish I 
wish I could like save this, but I can't. Apple pie has always been a favorite of mine. Thank you very much. You're welcome. That was very good. Yes. Eat one meal a day and you'll become... Oh, I don't need that. That's tutorial Bye. shit. Bye. We don't need to go through the tutorial. Um, let's see. Hmm. Let's save first. Because I don't want to have to go through that conversation with her again. voice. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. No. I'm gonna just like not give him a voice. Princess! <laughs> you are the princess, right? I've been waiting for you, princess. Oh! I still may or may not be a princess. So will you just call me Kala? Huh? Please? Yes. So cute. Please allow me to formally introduce myself. Ahem. Good morning. My name is Vishnal. I am training you to be a full-fledged butler. Although at times I may cause you trouble, <laughs> I am honored to serve you, Kella. Nice meeting you. Ask me anything about the fields. Literally. Let's go. Ready? Boop. 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 You can do it. The challenge is on. I'm sorry. Well, about besides getting married. Um, it's about basically getting your memories back. Um, there's like a lot of like the theme, the overall overarching theme basically is friendship um as with most of these games <laughs> but yeah it's friendship developing bonds with all of the townspeople prepared so in case the player names their character with something obscene um no i've named obs i've named them obscene before um i don't think there's anything off limits just like in Stardew, like one of my characters is like, like, buck, butt face or something on Dildo Farm. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, so it's it's basically making relationships and bonds with all the townspeople, and then also like, there's some stuff later on that causes conflict with uh, Venti, who's the dragon, that sort of thing. And Venti is basically the quote unquote god of the town. Um, which is called Selfia. Um, not really a god, but yes, a god. Uh... <laughs> Thank you. But I'm sure with a bit of elbow grease, you'll be able to fix her up in no time. Fallout 4 does that some names are said out loud. Oh, <laughs> wow. <laughs> so it's like, hey, butt face. I'll try my best. <laughs> Wait, that's Fenty's voice. Yeah, can I just like, yeah, thank you for giving me all of this stuff. I'd like to like just, yeah, thank you. I think Dickhead was one of them. <laughs> Good. How do I... I forgot. Oh. Yeah. 
this is not like as it might be the latency though I was gonna say this is not as responsive as the 3ds but it could be the capture card <laughs> Oh my god, latency. It's a little bit of lag. <sighs> yeah, but give me the stone. Damn it. I'll get, I'll get you later. Little biatch. I'll plant the one turnip seed you gave me. It's time to name this farm. Does that really? Does this really qualify as a farm? Yes. By building monster barns and befriending your livestock. You can collect their milk and share their wool. It will be a true farmland in due time. Wow. You can also have the monsters help you with your farm work. Thank you. Now please think of a name. Oh no, man. Uh Dickhead. No. Uh, I'm just gonna name it something like, um, J. J. Romance, like lovely. Lovely farm. Lovely. Oh my god, I can't even. Uh, I need a better capture card. <laughs> Lovely. Ah, oh, yes, yes. Oh. Wonderful. What a touching name. Although you might not have noticed yet, when do you, when you do productive work such as farming, your rune points begin to decrease. When you use up all of your rune points, your HP will start to start being consumed instead, making you faint from exhaustion if they fa fall too low. So please be careful. RP can be recovered by eating, bathing, or sleeping. I wish I could recover RP by bathing, and sleeping, and eating. At first you'll find yourself getting tired quite easily. However, as you get used to it, it'll be much easier to work. Here. Before you go, I have a present for you. Turnip feed! Thank you very much! Go take a nap! Honestly, I'm tired too. Um, it's like one. I should go take a nap also. Let's both take naps! It would be nice if Stardew did it the same instead of blacking out. Have to stay up and mark. Oh no, that sucks. I'm sorry. <laughs> So if you'd like to grow more crops, that's the place to visit. Well... Ah, and by the way, Lady Ventuswell is calling you. The center path leads to Lady Ventuswell's room. That would be the fastest way to get there. Can I pick this rock up yet? Nope. <sighs> Oops. Hmm. 
Uh, no, they're not nine. Four. I'm not used to this. So that's, uh, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine. Noise. Perfection. How goes the farm work? It's fun so far. You really are an Earthmate. Earthmate? Earthmates are those who can communicate with the Earth and monsters. They have long been enriching the Earth through farming. That bump on the head must have messed with you far more than I expected if you've forgotten that. How do you know what I've forgotten and what I haven't? Well, let's do an experiment. Come closer. Okay. What are we doing? Perhaps I can bring back your memory with my power. Well, really ish anyway. I can't guarantee anything. I mean, please let me try. Please? <laughs> all right, all right. Come on, let's go. Well? It's not working. So it doesn't work then after all. I can't bring back memory unless I'm involved in it. Why don't you just give up? How could I possibly do that? We at least know that you're a princess, so you mustn't worry. We don't know that yet at all. We do so, you're just being stubborn. How about you go out and do some meet and greet with the locals? Someone might recognize your face. Oh, that's true. I'll do that right now. Wait, Kala! What? When you're done asking around, will you come back here? Sure. Yes. There's like no way I can speed through this. Sorry. But don't be disappointed. There's still a chance that you're the princess. You can write a letter to the royal capital to confirm. And if all else fails, you can always start a new life here. Jeez. It's not that easy. I know, but I'm very serious. And I think in time, you too may find it the best course of action. This town is filled with warm-hearted people. They'll all welcome you with open arms. So there's no need to worry. <laughs> Cheer up. Venti. More than that. Excuse me. Oh. And you pray tell is addressing me. Yes. Arthur D. Lawrence, the thirteenth prince. Uh, Arthur D. Lawrence, the 13th Prince of Narad Kingdom. It's not going to be the same because, like, his actual voice, like, in the, in the game doesn't sound like that. Yes, 
Arthur D. Lawrence, the 13th Prince of Norad. I will be staying here in Selfia starting today. Lady Ventuswill, I kindly ask for your guidance. Um. Are you the prince? Yes. I thought I sent a letter stating that I would be arriving today. What? See, I told you it wasn't me. There's no way I could be the princess. No. Oh, be quiet already. E even a perfect being can make a mistake or two in life. Hmm. Um. Oh, <clears throat> so you are the true prince then. Well, how do I explain? I'm a bit at a loss here. Ah, that's it! The person here claimed to be the princess despite having no corroborating evidence. We'd never seen your face, so we had no choice but to believe the little troublemaker. What? You're the one who kept insisting I was royalty. Shut up, he'll hear us. That's why we've given away the room which was prepared for you, I'm afraid. We beg your forgiveness. Oh my. We take full responsibility for this grievous error, and we'll do what we can to make it right. Kel, I'm sorry. Sorry. I really am sorry. Will you stay at the end for a while? I'll let them know. <sighs> okay. It's alright. I wasn't supposed to be here in the first place. Excuse me. Please wait. What will you do? Where will you go? Well, I'll stay at the end until everything's settled. I'm sorry, Kala. Please don't be. No. There's no need for that. <laughs> this must have happened for a reason. Kala, was it? What do you think? Will you trade places with me and serve as representative to the kingdom? I like who he's like, serve as a representative to the kingdom, even though I don't know if you're an enemy or a friend. If you are an enemy, serve anyway. <sighs> Bye, your break. I will be right back. Stab her in the tail. No, dude! Mean! <laughs>
super tired, so I'm gonna go like take a nap. I feel like a migraine coming on. So, thank you for hanging out with me. You're like the best.